Heavy storm damage left people in the Dennis Cove area of Carter County without power until late last night. Cleanup efforts are underway to clear out fallen wood, which is being sold to those who need it. The area's campsite will also remain closed for the next week. News Channel 11's Catherine Simpson was in Carter County today and has more details. We have large swaths of forest that have been laid on the ground. We have substantial damage to the campground with multiple large trees laid down. Severe wind damage is still impacting the Dennis Cove area days after storms whipped through the Tri-Cities on Monday evening. The most comparable thing were the storms that hit in the summer of 2016 around Watauga Lake. National Weather Service employees inspected the damage Wednesday, investigating whether the confirmed tornado that touched down in neighboring Avery County, North Carolina might have originated in Tennessee. Meanwhile, Forest Service employees continued to clear debris. We'll try to salvage some of the logs if we can and uh, sell firewood permits and then get the campground back in order. Forest technician Matthew Gilbert says they'll try their best to reuse as much of the fallen wood as they can, selling some to a nearby wood business. Though the damage was severe, Gilbert says the fallen trees will make way for new growth that can serve as bird habitats. We live in what is practically a rainforest in the Appalachians. So it's a very resilient landscape. In Hampton, Katherine Simpson, News Channel 11.